What's your name? Stella Johnson in Sea Castle. Where did you grow up? McLennan, Alberta, Gihnistaugen, with the big Gihigian. And how many people were there when you grew up? Oh, maybe a thousand. I'm not too sure. Could have been more or less. <laughs> uh, what languages did you hear or speak when you were growing up? Uh, mostly Cree. Um, we were raised in a French community, so there was French. And I didn't realize that uh, when my grandmother was talking some Michif language, I thought she was just poor French, what she was. Because <laughs> uh, she'd say some things like Libata, La Patak, and, you know, but most of it was predominantly Greek. Did you take part in any traditional activities or customs? Well, my grandmother was already probably in her 70s when she raised, so we didn't. Uh, we used to go to Lake St. Anne on, on the pilgrimage. That was her traditional thing. Uh, we didn't attend like powwows or different things like that. We, um, she would take me visiting her sisters or her aunts or relatives, and that would be things that we would do. Were you raised by your grandmother? Yes, my grandmother raised me, and that's why I'm able to speak the Cree language. Uh, who was your most influential person in your life? Oh, of course, my grandmother, and also my father because of his strength and his... Um, he was um, paralyzed on one side because of having uh, polio, but he did everything. You very powerful man. What were your chores and responsibilities when you were growing up? Oh, uh, wash clothes, mm. and do laundry, wash the floors, and just regular house work. Um, my grandmother did all the cooking, but we used to go and pick berries. We'd go to the muskeg and pick uh, low, bush, low bush cranberries and blueberries and also some wild peppermint and um, just different little herbs and stuff, simple little herbs for holds and, and that. 